May the Lord bless you and protect you. May the Lord smile on you and be gracious to you. May the Lord show you his favor and give you peace. As we listen to the word of God. June 1, 2024 Saturday of the 8th week in Ordinary Time Memorial of St. Justin, Martyr First reading, a reading from the letter of Jude, chapter 1, verses 17 and 20b to 25. Beloved, remember what you were told in the past by the apostles of our Lord Jesus Christ. Keep on building yourselves up on your most sacred faith. Pray in the power of the Holy Spirit. and keep yourselves in the love of God as you wait for our Lord Jesus Christ in his mercy to give you eternal life show mercy towards those who have doubts save others by snatching them out of the fire and to others show mercy mixed with fear but hate their very clothes stained by their sinful lust to him who is able to keep you from falling and to bring you faultless and joyful before his glorious presence to the only god our savior through jesus christ our lord be glory majesty might and authority from all ages past and now and for ever and ever amen the word of the lord thanks be to god response to your psalm your response my soul is thirsting for you o lord my god o god you are my god whom i seek for you my flesh pines and my soul thirsts like the earth parched lifeless and without water your response my soul is thirsting for you o lord my god thus have i gazed toward you in the sanctuary to see your power and your glory for your kindness is a greater good than life my lips shall glorify you your response my soul is thirsting for you o lord my god Thus will I bless you while I live lifting up my hands I will call upon your name as with the riches of a banquet shall my soul be satisfied and with exultant lips my mouth shall praise you your response my soul is thirsting for you o lord my god the acclamation alleluia alleluia let the word of christ dwell in you richly giving thanks to god the father through him alleluia alleluia gospel a reading from the holy gospel according to mark chapter 11 verses 27 to 33 they arrived once again in jerusalem as jesus was walking in the temple the chief priests the teachers of the law and the elders came to him and asked him What right have you to do these things? Who gave you this right? Jesus answered them, I will ask you just one question, and if you give me an answer, I will tell you what right I have to do these things. Tell me, where did John's right to baptize come from? Was it from God or from human beings? they started to argue among themselves what shall we say if we answer from god he will say why then did you not believe john but if we say from human beings they were afraid of the people because everyone was convinced that john had been a prophet so their answer to jesus was we don't know Jesus said to them neither will i tell you then 
by what right i do these things the gospel of the lord praise to you lord jesus christ today's gospel reflection my dear brothers and sisters in christ jesus do you feel the freedom and joy that come from living under christ's rule then let us carry on with our daily numerous prayers for wisdom regardless of the extent of our knowledge so many of the decisions that are needed of us will be inadequate if we rely solely on knowledge my dear friends to set the scene and direct application wisdom is required we are aware that when we focus our souls on seeking wisdom and paying attention to the song it sings we will feel joy in our hearts let us pray lord show me what joy and freedom your authority brings into my life lord teach me your methods so that i can live by your word and become more aware of your truth amen saint justin pray for us my dear friends please do like share and subscribe thanks for watching god bless you